Another thing that happened on my walk this morning is that I was thinking about, well, I need to make some money. How am I going to do that? There's lots of different jobs available. I could have my pick of a lot of them. I don't really know that I actually want to do any of them. Uh, I'm kind of getting analysis paralysis just from thinking about all of the different things that I could do and which one's going to serve me the best. And so I've been postponing the decision. We get to a point now where it's getting to be essential that I pick one just in order to make some kind of money. But it could also, uh, yeah, it's just, it's tough. So then I got to thinking, well, picking a job is kind of like picking a girlfriend um, or a significant other. And that's just that, you know, it might look a certain way on the surface. And then when you get into the relationship or the job, then um, you find out that things are different than you thought or that they're, and it could be in a good way, it could be in a bad way, it could be in just kind of like a, a lateral way where it's like, oh, I didn't really know this was part of it, but actually this is cool. Or, oh, wow, I really don't like this. I didn't realize I was going to have to do this, this aspect of this job. And um, yeah, there's sort of this uh, surface presentation and how much can you see into what's behind that? And, you know, you're evaluating jobs and people and situations in life in all of these ways. And I guess your ability to discern these things allows you to have realistic expectations or expectations that are not realistic. And, um, yeah, I was just thinking about that. And I was like, wow, that's kind of an interesting way to look at it. Uh, yeah. And uh, I understand my hesitation to uh, enter into a job and into a relationship. It kind of makes all this sense to me.